I cannot put into words how excited I am to be doing one of these videos and not have it be Drake or Kendrick Lamar because their beef going back and forth with their diss track straight up burnt me out. So I had to take a step back, recharge the batteries, but we back today. We back with Vince Staples. He's dropping off his first single from his upcoming album called Shame on the Devil. And anytime we get new Vince Staples music, it's always a moment. It's always a cause for excitement. Ever since he dropped uh, his self-titled album, Vince Staples, a few years ago, uh, his, his his quality has just seemed to just uh, take a huge leap. And uh, yeah, anytime he drops, I'm here for it. So y'all know the drill. Roll one up. Hit that subscribe button. And let's get it. I long for loving and affection. These hoes ain't what I need. I need direction. Don't leave me, please. Swear I learned my lesson. But I still chase thrills, I'm imperfected. I don't want to talk on the phone, leave me a message. Hey, Voices facts, bro. Well, first of all, this sounded like mature Vince Staples. And anytime you see a rapper go from maybe the not not so mature version of themselves, and you see the, the, the maturation, and you kind of see the progress, bro, it's a great thing to see. Also, that line about uh, leave me a message, don't, don't call me type shit. Bro, that's my motto, bro. If it can be in a message and it doesn't have to be over the phone, it just just leave me a message, bro. If it can be texted, text me, bro. Don't leave me, please. Swear I learned my lesson. But I still chase thrills. I'm imperfected. I don't want to talk on the phone. Leave me yeah, a message. message. Voices still in my head. Voices still in my head. Beef with my closest of friends and make no amends. I'd rather kill them instead. Out of the rumors to spread. You pick the one that's going to get us some fair time. Damn. Damn. Damn, he said, uh, uh, beef with my closest of friends and make no amends, I'd rather kill him instead. So instead of patching the shit up with, with the, somebody who I consider a close friend, I'd rather just kill him instead, I'd rather just get rid of him instead. That, you know, is kind of speaking to the, the immaturity I was talking about, you know, when we first kind of found out about Vince, where his head was. And I'm sure he might, not, might be speaking of, through his through his eyes uh, from the past, or he might be speaking through the eyes of somebody who's still got this type of mindset that he uh, that he might know that he might know. Out of all the rumors to spread, you pick the one that's gonna get us some Fed time. Corey's still calling with the deadlines, so I think here he's saying, bro, out of all everything that you could say and you could make up, you pick some made up shit that's gonna get us in trouble with the law. That's gonna fuck everything up, bro. You could have just made up a lie and said that we we you know. Uh, we were fucking on uh, 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 Keisha the other day or whatever. You could have made up some trivial lie like that, but instead, you lying and making up some rumors and some shit that's gonna fuck everybody up. I'm glad I pulled up the lyrics for this shit too Because I probably wouldn't have been able to make that out What the hook is But apparently this uh, features Baby Rose Who I've definitely seen on like features and shit before When this hook he's saying Shame on the devil I'm touched by an angel The Lord made me special I pray for days like this So that kind of says to me Shame on the devil for even trying to uh, uh, fuck shit up in my life. Shame on the devil. I'm touched by an angel. Like, I got God on this side of me. So shame on the devil for even trying to mess stuff up. Trying to even go against uh, this angel that I'm touched by. The Lord made me special. God made me special. I prayed for days like this. So going back to shame on the devil. I'm touched by an angel. Maybe he's having a good ass day maybe some real good shit happened maybe you got some real good news or something he's saying shame on the devil for trying to take this shit away from me the lord made me special i prayed for days like this i prayed for to have the life that i have and the luxuries that this life has afforded me and shit i like this hook i like hooks like this that you can kind of uh it's not really celebratory in nature it's not like a celebratory song like congratulations is by post malone but this is the type of shit after whatever victory that you have in your life, you can sit back, smoking, relax, and you finally by yourself, you can just 
reflect on and you can enjoy those uh those successes mission complete out of the mud label the leader they follow and could light on my feet floating above i don't be creeping and keeping in touch i know some hoes that'll pull up to give me some pussy before they come give me a hug shit is the dust in mud then only the heavens can judge look what i'm juggling only the heavens can judge hell no bro i'm judging every time he said i know some hoes that'll pull up and give me the pussy before they give me a hug so they, they give me the pussy like behind closed doors and shit. They'll give it up like that. But, you know, they'll give it up way quicker than, you know, in public sh showing any sort of affection. In public claiming anybody. But behind closed doors, they doing all that shit. I like the flow that he started off with too. Mission complete, out of the mud, labeled the leader. They following cuz. They following me. You know what I mean? Maybe I didn't even ask for this position, but they following me. They appointed me a leader. Light on my feet, floating above. I don't be creeping or keeping in touch. I know some hoes that'll pull up and give me some pussy. Bro, there's many reasons why your boy's single. But the dating pool out here, it is full of bitches like that. So, I, I ain't for it. Passing the gate to pull up on bait. Getting them Malibu chills. No, we not talking as much as we should. Know that I'm proud of you still. Sliding for Shelly and Phil. If I don't do it, who will? Tell me who shoot for the shooters. Who gon' let Catherine Medusa? Life is a bitch, hit it and quit. Deal with the karma, the sutra. Focus on karma like future. Uh, deal with the karma, the sutra. Man, real random thought. I need Vince Staples and Isaiah Rashad on a track. Like this track, I, I would kill to have an Isaiah Rashad verse on this shit. He would sound amazing on this. But Vince... Vince, time and time again, he seems like he's almost like, I don't want to say tortured. Maybe that's um, maybe that's too extreme of a word. He really seems conflicted being popular, popular enough to be, you know, featured on songs with your favorite rappers and shit and to be held in a high regard as far as the rap shit goes, but still holding on to that, that, that hood part of him. You know what I mean? That, that hood part, because he's mentioning all these people and, you know, who, who who's going to slide for them if nobody else does, so I do it type shit. He sound like he's like caught in the middle between staying in the hood, staying to his roots and shit, and, you know, um, making his own path and making it out of that shit. Uh, it's, it's, it, that, that kind of subject matter shows up time and time again. I think it's just woven into uh, the fabric of, of who Vince Staples is, at least who he's presented to the world. <laughs> this part right here is gonna hit on, on one of those bad days when you really need a prayer i didn't love that one as much as i loved like some of the other singles that he he dropped uh for uh, ramona park or uh vince staples or anything like that but i really do enjoy that as a single Maybe not what I would have chose as a single, but I don't know what else is on, on the album. He knows far better than I would. But I probably wouldn't have chose that as a first single. I think this is going to sound very good within the, the fabric of the album. I think it's 11, 12 songs, something like that. I think it'll sit really nice uh, off the back of a different song or lead into a different song and stuff. But as a standalone, I really don't want to call it mids, but I can't give it too dope. So whenever I'm in between the two, gotta drop it down to some mids that's not bad mids that mids gonna it's gonna do what it needs to do you know what i mean that shit's it's going on the playlist i'm sure that might be one that grows on me with more listens you know what i mean by the end of the year it could be one of my favorite songs who knows but i'll first listen just some mids on the dope scale i appreciate y'all stopping by and kicking it with me today if you fuck with the video that you just watched consider hitting that subscribe button down below check out another video i covered popping up right here and remember, if it's not too dope, then it's probably mids.